Juliet's Corner and today is December 4 8 22 p.m. and I would like to thank everybody who already subscribed to this channel and for those who haven't subscribed don't forget to click subscribe button after you watch this video so you can um, follow me in this journey my business my my channel is all about business um, I'm making hoodies, tees, all are handmade with, you know, my Cricut at the back, Cricut machine. Right now, I'm doing vinyl, so probably later on, I'm gonna try the screen printing for a change, or we'll see what's the difference, or what are the good um, quality, which one is better, which one is best, so we're gonna try that out later, or, you know, uh, sooner. I have the materials already. I'm currently selling in Etsy uh, shop. I don't have the website yet. And uh, for those who are new here, welcome to my channel. So today's video is I'm gonna show you guys on basic steps. It's easy. Uh, steps on how I fulfill or how I pack my order how how I make label using pirate ship so before that I'm gonna give you a so before basically this video is all about how I pack or how I do label using pirate ship um, but on the other hand I'm gonna show you like tips on how I pack what are the what are the items or materials that I used to use in packing orders especially if my, my packaging uh, or poly mailer is not enough on the quantity or let's say for example I only have a small available um, poly mailer bag and I have to, to fit two items to help you also to maximize your materials that you have anyways to proceed I'm gonna show you first the materials that I use in packing the orders of course we're gonna need some poly mailer bag this one I got this in Amazon and it says it's compostable 100% so it's eco-friendly and then I have the measuring tape I have the thank you sticker I, and then you you're gonna have a thank you card sorry it's the other way around but it says thank you and then the back one is blank I just did this um, I'll show you in a separate video on how to make this also it's easy and simple step just like this print it in your computer and in in your printer and this is just a card stock that I got in Michaels plain one that you can write your notes in there and then I have my business card you're gonna have this um, the, the tape and then you're gonna have your weighing scale I got this in Amazon and the items that you need to pack with the right now I have this um, tissue paper okay so right now I'm gonna show you on how to maximize the poly mailer bag that I have since this one the one that I have is kind of small and I have to fit two hoodies in there so let's go
on this part you have to remove this one and you can flip this on the other side so it's one whole new package or poly mailer bag I need to put the tissue paper in the hoodie it's just kind of like you know um, presentation of my packaging This is my business card. That's how you do the pack for this poly mailer. So now I'm going to show you on how I print my label using the pirateship.com. You're gonna create shipping label. So you're gonna enter the information like the name and the address so that part I'm not gonna show you that I'll be right back after this um, before I cut off this part so you just they just need the name of the receiver and then the address and with a zip code and everything like that and then at the bottom you're gonna be able to see what packaging did you use so I'm gonna pick later this one so they need the dimension that's why earlier I have the the measuring tape and then the package weight which is the one that I showed you earlier is I have the weighing scale so that's where I use the um, item and then you're just gonna get the rate and once it send you to the next page it's the total amount that you're going to pay for the shipping so 
I'll be right back. So this is our package. And we're gonna need the length and the width of this package. So So the length is 13 by 13 by 14 So it's 14 by 14 So for the weight it's 2.6 oh, 2 pounds and 6.7 ounces so here is the next um, page after I put all the information, the name, the address, the weight, the weight and the length, the size of the package. And then when you hit buy label or, or um, get the rate, then it will tell you the total um, amount over here. And then ship date is tomorrow so you have to hit buy label after you buy the label then you're gonna print the label and make sure you're connected to the printer so you're gonna hit print over here and then the printer hey guys so i am i'm back and i already print the label over here and this is our package and we're just gonna attach it here with the, the tape So that's how I pack my package that's where I get my label in the pirate ship it's so easy just registered pirateship.com connect your bank account here for the charges I'm gonna repeat it's pirateship.com one word pirateship.com and that's how simple it was when I'm making a label at home so i guess this video helped you guys if you think this video helped you don't forget to give me a huge thumbs up follow this um channel share this channel and thank you for watching everyone and until next time bye